In an attempt to learn more about the details of various colleges across the nation, Kathy Faust interviewed Karen Watts, a former student of Ball State University. While Karen describes her overall experience as educational, academically, as well as socially, she did point out some things that future Ball State students should avoid. Freshman 15. The term freshman 15 alludes to the weight gain that many freshmen experience when they are introduced to all of the cuisine options and late night study sessions that involved snacks. According to Karen, sometimes it's best to set an actual schedule for visits to the dining hall because the dining options are just amazing. They even include several all-you-can-eat buffets. Identity theft. Karen says it hasn't hit the students just yet, but at least 80 members of Ball State faculty have had their identity stolen. Many of them learned of it after they got a debit card from the IRS that they never applied for. It seems that their taxes were fraudulently filed. Because of this, many students have chosen to have their funds dispersed to their bank accounts rather than generic debit cards. In addition, some students have frozen their credit as a precaution and only unfreeze it as needed. Peer-to-peer -peer file sharing. We all know piracy is illegal, but it's tempting to go ahead and share that song with your friend. Now the stakes are a bit higher. Not only can students have to deal with litigation, but potential academic death as well. Ball State takes piracy very seriously and has strict policies against peer-to-peer -peer sharing, so it's best to just avoid this road altogether. Even if you beat the charges from authorities, you still have to face potential issues with your education. Overload the competition to stand out among the other students in the hopes of cultivating a stellar resume and academic record was utterly exhausting. If you plan to stand out among the rest, she suggests limiting the amount of classes you take as well as the amount of clubs and organizations you get involved with. College life at Ball State can be fun and open you up to new experiences, but you don't want so many experiences that you become overwhelmed and unable to complete the task at hand. Walking alone at night. Ball State isn't alone in this issue. College students are notorious for being targets for predators. Karen was cautious enough to stick with the buddy system even if she was just going out for a cup of coffee. She also kept her room well stocked so she could limit the number of times she would potentially have to leave her room alone at night. For added protection, she suggests self-defense classes and small self-defense items like mace on a keychain or even just keeping a key firmly grasped in your hand while walking. So be sure to check out our website for more tips on attending colleges and universities.